Good afternoon. This is Mark Mentink with the Grain Market Update for the week ending June 7th. After a choppy week, nearby and new crop corn both finished the week 10 to 12 cents lower. As been the case in the last few weeks, weather seems to be the market mover. The difference being this week, weather allowed for planters to get rolling in the many areas. Last week's report had us just around 67% planted with thoughts that we could be as high as 85% planted on Monday's report. It looks like the tariffs on Mexico are going to <coughs> go in effect on Monday unless something would happen over the weekend. Overall, the market is looking to decrease corn acres and yield, but there's a chance that the exports will also be decreased at some point, time will tell. The same can be said for the bean market, with both nearby and new crop being down 20 to 22 cents for the week. Beans are being planted in less corn acres, could mean more bean acres for this year. And China, our largest bean buyer, is still out of the market. Last Monday's U.S. report came out at 39% versus the 79% average. What gets put in this week remains to be seen, but some guesses coming in around 60 plus percent versus 88 from last year. Wheat was also a follower of the corn and bean market this week, but managed to finish the week basically where it started. Crop ratings for all wheat has not really changed a lot since last week and the market still struggles with a large inventory carryover on the balance sheet. Late this morning it was reported that prevent plant acres will likely not be eligible for any of the tariff subsidies. Monday the crop progress report comes out and should show progress in corn and bean plantings. In general the market will continue to trade weather and rumors for the near future. Make sure you watch the markets for any selling opportunities and come up and have offers in place. Thanks for listening and have a good weekend.